Easy guys, Storm here from Cringy Dad Gaming. So in this video I'll be giving you a few tips on how I took down Adam Smasher from the game Cyberpunk 2077. This guy is pretty much robot completely apart from his head, there's very little human left in him so any weapon that you have shock damage on it will do additional damage to him. But also we are running EMP grenades because they are not only going to do additional damage against him but they're also at certain points going to incapacitate him for a short period leaving him open to attack. Now the great thing about doing this mission is hopefully you've chose a buddy to come along with you depending on which story arc you've taken or which ending you're going for. They will draw fire sometimes for you allowing you to reload or heal if you need to. Don't forget your quick hacks, even though they are very, very expensive against Adam Smasher, you are probably able to use some against him at some point. And also notice there's that little weak spot on his chest there that you just noticed. Now we've just managed to explode that using an EMP grenade, which has totally took off his right arm. He has a number of weapons that he'll use. He'll use this assault rifle on his left arm and he's also got this rocket launcher on one of his shoulders. Both are pretty damaging if you are out in the open when he fires them, so it's best to try and use cover as much as possible. Now the great thing about this area is there is quite a lot of cover to use. Now some enemies will come in and try and help him as well, they're not as hard as him so it's just a matter of trying to get away from Adam while you're taking out these other enemies so you're not getting incapacitated or overrun by too many enemies. If you're taking the battle at range, then why not switch out to a sniper rifle if you've got one. For those of you who watched my battle with Oda will know that I used the sniper rifle pretty much for the whole of that boss battle. And I probably could have done the same here with Adam, but because of just how quickly he's moving and how long it takes to reload the sniper rifle with only four rounds in it, I just found that it was a little bit quicker for me to use something like the shotgun that had the shock damage on it. But while he's firing these rockets, if you can get behind cover while he's doing it, you may have the opportunity to get a headshot or two on him because he does bend down and uh, his, his head is very still at that point, allowing you to get some additional damage. Now I've run out of EMP grenades at this point and now I'm using flash grenades. The great thing about Adam is not only is he mainly all robot, but he's also partly human, which means his eyes are human, allowing you to use the flashbang grenades to be able to temporarily blind him. I found that also to be quite efficient in this particular battle. So again, just up nice and close, trying to get some shots on him with the shotgun. He's now down to 19% health, so we've almost got him at this stage. Now even though he is blinded there, he will blind fire sometimes when you've used the flashbang, so just be aware of that and just try and avoid his assault weapon that he has. So at this point the flashbang managed to knock him down and we're just going to pump a few extra rounds in him while we get the opportunity. He's now down to 4% health, really close and at this stage we've managed to be Adam Smasher. If you guys have taken any tips from this video, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Watch this space for more Cyberpunk 2077 and I'll catch you guys on another video. Thanks for watching. You're ready for this. Yo, who's the daddy?